There's a camcorder there or something. My heart's not uh, quite situated yet. I still got Jumanji drums in my chest. <laughs> Jumanji drums in my chest. Uh, okay. Alice's video camera. No okay. memory card inside. Okay, I guess I need a memory card. What's this? Um. Video art doc on screens. Focal point. The dark place. And you were eating SpaghettiOs or something. Okay. Perfect. Nice house, by the way. Jesus. Big ass kitchen with an island. Lovely. Uh, part one. Part one. There's a memory card. What was Alice working on? And someone else was eating spaghetti. Was she eating the same spaghetti multiple times? All right. I mean, I don't need my flashlight on. He takes. It takes so long for him to pull the flashlight out. It feels like I should always have it out. Uh, memory card. I don't look a real ass person. I <laughs> can. When I was younger, photography was everything to me. Uh huh. I moved to New York thinking I'd make it as an artist. And then I met Alan. That's me. We had a good thing. We were both dedicated by our creative ambitions. The only difference was that Alan's work made money. Damn. What a loser. An could. artist. <laughs> Idiot. I mean, I guess they both are, but like, you know, could you imagine being an artist and trying to make money? She can't afford this house with that with them shitty ass photos. I'm kidding, by the way. For any photographers in here, I'm just being a troll. For any artists in here, you guys know. We loved each other. What's she talking about, dude? I'm kidding. I'm listening. Then uh, Alan hit a block. I brought out a meaner side of him. One I didn't like. The Mr. Scratch side. I set up a trip to see a doctor in Washington. I didn't tell him until we got there. Yeah, that was the first game. We argued. And he was pissed. Things went wrong. That was her fault. Was just gone. He said he wanted to escape and like enjoy a vacation. Perfectly. And she set him up with like some kind of brain doctor so he can get inspired or some shit. I like how I'm just... <laughs> Oh. About six years ago, I started hearing noises in the night. Typewriter keys clacking. There's artists in this stream? Yeah, I know. Voices. Dumbasses trying to make money doing art. Alan was back. Omega lol. Haunting me. Damn, dude, we're about to give her uh, an Oscar. She's doing all this acting. It was Alan. And yet, it was a monster. So yeah, she is talking about Mr. Scratch. He always did have anger in him. But it might be just Alan. I forgot the first game a lot. I <laughs> but still. Now I'm scared again because of what she just said. The world is so much darker than they ever knew. I'm calling this exhibit the dark place. 
Don't talk about this anymore. Alice. The scratch was terrorizing her. It's breathing. Why? This is what the fuck with me. He's just standing there breathing. <sighs> He's like snarling. Arr! It's the real ass Mr. Alan Wake guy, actor guy. I sat in the writer's room and wrote a story. Initiation. To project myself through the dark place. Mm -hmm. To look for a way out. The story had brought me here, brought me nowhere. Loop me back. I was writing this story. Being a writer must be. The story, I now stepped into the writer's room. I feel like it's harder to. Actually, I don't know if it's no harder to be a writer. Writing. I don't know. Being a writer just seems like there is. It's really hard to like see if you have tangible evidence that you're like good at it. Unless, I guess if you're a writer, you would know, but I don't know. Uh, Alan Wake got whacked. End of part. All right, that part was a little bit more chillax, not really scary. Just one really fucked up jump scare. More music. The same song. Next. <laughs> but like, that was not that bad. That was actually a nice break from that fucking shitty subway. Which was a nightmare. I'm homegirl again? I think I am. I'm back to being a cop or an FBI agent. Hey. She's cool. Okay, let's recap what you've told us so far, Ellen. For the past 13 years, you've been trapped in a nightmare dimension called the Dark Place. Yeah. It's like New York, but it's not New York. And can be reached from the bottom of Cauldron Lake, but it's not really under the lake. And after all this, <laughs> look at his face. To get out. Yeah, yeah. But so has your evil doppelganger, Mr. Scratch, or is it the Dark Presence? Both. It's interchangeable. He's Scratch when he looks like me, but he can change into this. Other form. And Scratch, the Dark Presence, wants to rewrite the world in his own image. Which would be in your image, as he looks just like you. And turn the world into a fucking nightmare. During Deerfest, which is scheduled to take place in a couple of days. Great. You got out of the dark place by writing a novel, the pages we've been finding. But your double edited it into a horror story that's now changing reality, taking over people, yeah. making them crazy. Bringing the dark place to Bright Falls. Yes. Fiction coming in contact with the dark place can change reality. The story is coming true. So I really do like the like, face animations in this game. Like darkness when, it, when night falls. But last time... It, this will be back in 2010. Yes. Last time it didn't happen all at once. The story came true bit by bit as it unfolded. And that dark presence was still bound to the lake. I stopped it before it got the ending it wanted. <laughs> Sounds like a whole ass I'm psycho. Free. I think this is legitimately real. I always forget, but like, There's I think time. in the first game, the clicker. it really Magical makes you think that it's like not it's real at all, but like, it, it is real. Like, it's real, real. That can't happen. And I think they're making that distinction, like, de like determined on how. I can send him back to the dark place, make Just hold on. This shit go away. This guy talks a lot. <laughs> I talk a lot Look, <laughs> as this guy's trying to cutscene the cutscene. I know it's batshit crazy. My memory is, is full of holes, and I, I'm not sure how much I can trust. It, it's like it's like it's like a half forgotten dream. <laughs> I 
<laughs> the synchronized coffee drinking again. Mr. Wake, Alan, we've seen our share of batshit crazy in the past 24 hours. What I want to know is, why am I? Why are we written into the story? I too. I, I, I forgot about that part. Our vision of you in the dark place. I think you helped me reach out and escape somehow. With that in the story, Scratch would have edited it to get to you. To hurt you. Uh-huh. Sure. We are all in danger. I mean, she's literally... They both seen it, I think. Well, actually, I don't know about her partner. I know he's... I, I'm the only one that's killed some weird shit. It's insane. And there's so much of it. Yay. All right. What was I going to say? What'd you say? It sounds about the same uh, as being a writer versus an illustrator. You still need people to look at your work and see what some of the areas are right and wrong. Yeah, but like... I think as an artist, even with art, you can look at your own art and be like, that's a certain level of quality. But sometimes writing can be very like, I think writing has a lot of, there's a lot of creativity within writing and there's a lot of rules to break. But there's also kind of like rules of language and rules of writing in that, in like other sense. And so it's like hard to like, it's just, I don't know. It's just like, to me, it's, it, I feel like it's not as easy as it seems. Um, I guess if you're being more expressive, I guess there's, I guess it's the same. I guess it is the same, but I think art is something that's more of a, has a level of emotional impact where like when you look at it, it's like, bam, art. While when you have to read something, you have to have like certain levels of capabilities and understanding and nuance that I think visual art, it's kind of like music, how music I think is a, something that can be just consumed regardless of your expertise or your knowledge of thing. Um, music is just something, even if you're listening to music in a different language, you can have a visceral reaction to it. Um, anyway, I'm just fucking rambling about shit that doesn't matter. Let me talk to this uh, feller. Or is there a save I can do? Quick save. Um, cool. But yeah, I was gonna say the difference in the enemies in Alan Wake's nightmare compared to the enemies I've killed so far here. The enemies I've killed here, after I like flashlight flashbanged them, they had like physical body parts that I had to shoot and blow up off of them. But like Alan Wake, it was just very vague and like they were, I was like shooting like these shadow monsters. Um, so I think that's probably like a part of telling me that this is actually this is an actual reality and there is like a supernatural element that's causing all this shit uh have you ever heard of the cult yeah. of the tree creepy bunch in the habit of wearing deer masks performing murder rituals creepy bunch is turning into monsters possessed by darkness possibly inspired by a horror story written by a certain author hmm ring any bells cult <laughs> yes Yes, they have the clicker. Um, are they working with Scratch? If the cult has the clicker, what's does the clicker? That make them Scratch's followers. How are you so certain they even have the clicker? What's the clicker? A flashlight? For Scratch, I don't remember. It's all confused. Alan, if I'm going to act on this information, you need to be honest with me. Yeah, of course. Is he confused? Or is he hiding something? What the hell was that? We're doing profiling. Come in here, Mr. Wake, you fucking lion scheming. What are you up to? We finna racially profile this hot boy. I'm kidding. All right, let's, uh, what do you got going on, Mr. Wake? Um. Wake said the cult has the clicker. How does he know? The writer is the reader. The next chapter, the next chapter, the next chapter. 
keep the pages safe, the dark shining of the words. Was he talking Wait, like that? Pages. That's how he knows the cult has the clicker. Oh, okay. Wake has a double. Mr. Scratch. Where is he now? A cloud of wrath wears my face. The dark place in your place. <laughs> Scratching out my body. This guy's on drugs. Scratch is here. In Washington. He's hunting Wake. How what kind of deduction is that? Okay, whatever. Scratch looks just like Wake. Why? Don't wake up the dreamer if your life is a dream. I swam to the shore, but the water is rising. Wake and Scratch are clearly connected. drugs. Maybe Scratch got out because Wake did. Or vice versa. Okay. So now we have all this information. You're hiding pages, bitch. Okay. Mr. Wake, I know you have more pages of the manuscript on you. You don't understand how vital these pages are. They're the only way I can know what's coming. You're not the only one trying to solve this. This is our job. Okay. Here. You know what I thought about this is G is I'm assuming GTA is gonna have similar, if not better, like mocap of this, which I, is crazy to think of. Uh GTA 6, that is. Inside the trailer, at the outskirts of Watery, Saga had seen Wake's fabled clicker for the first time in the hands of the cult of the tree. A cultist Great. stared at her. She drew her weapon. Are we finna shoot some uh, cultists? Um, okay. Now what? Do I just go in my handy way? I'm not even gonna say anything? Like, hey, I'm out to go investigate, partner. G guess I'll go. Wake has more information. What? I need to keep questioning him. What? There's no prompt. Did I need to? Do I need to profile harder? Oh, maybe I need to go to the board and uh, do some case stuff. Oh, maybe I need to look at the manuscript page. I already looked at that case board. Oh, here we go. Cases. Lunchbox. Oh, wait, wait. What? Wake just gave us a lot of information. Cool. But this clicker seems like a good place to start. But what is if the... We that, do we know what the clicker is? Uh, Fusion Tech, hello. Great. This thing, this is... I'm gonna get bullied by this fucking thing all over again. Oh, I fucked up. Uh, this. Huh? Wait, I wasn't... I wasn't done yet. God, the menu is so we weird sometimes. Huh? There we go. I didn't do that last time. Alright, the story. The pages we've been finding are from a horror story called Return. Written by Alan Wake. Return all. And the contents of this book are coming true. It clicks. It have been a romance. <laughs> it's a TV. It's a remote controller or something. Oh my God! Look at all this shit I got. Wait, what is this? Uh, Wake fiction coming into contact with the dark place. How does the story change reality and the rules? Last time, it didn't happen all at once. The story came true bit by bit as it unfolded. <clears throat> My goodness. What the hell? There's a lot of shit. Uh, she's going to get frustrated at me getting frustrated at me not knowing how this shit works still. Um, the story changes our reality.
for later, for later, for later, for later, for later, for later, for later. No, wait. Oh, God, I'm so dumb. The dark place. I have that. The dark presence. The dark presence is uh, Mr. Scratch. Uh, we need to stop Mr. Scratch. What is it? The flashlight seems to weaken the Taken. Wake, Scratch, and the dark presence are interchangeable. I'm a ger I'm an investigator. Choppy, what up, Choppy? Uh, happy Wednesday. Um, form of the scratch and the dark present editing week's story wants to turn the world into a nightmare. Um, hmm. wait, wouldn't it be this? No. What didn't I do? Never mind. Double edited it into a horror story that's now changing reality, taking over people. Uh, must get the clicker before Scratch. Uh, if you don't stop, Scratch will... What is this? <clears throat> don't make noises because I don't know what the fuck's going on. Hold up, dude. Relax, lady. Um, how to stop the story. Um, we have to... There you go. I'm doing stuff. And we have to get the book before Scratch does. And now we have no idea what the fuck the clicker is, but maybe it's a flashlight. It's not. The clicker, question mark. Okay. Huh. Oh, it's over here. It's like a big gap over here. I think for now, there might not be anything I can do. So when it's reality, a dark place er, uh, merged with ours. Uh, this place and the dark place. The page. Wait, the dark place. The page called this area overlap. So that's something down here. Huh? Are you fucking with me? Put it here. No. What do you mean No. <laughs> Where else would it go? <laughs> Let's check. He scratch when he looks like me, but he can change into this other form. All right, we're 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 brain we're braining lightly. We're not braining as brainly as we should be braining, but we're brain we're kind of brainy. I think I did maybe enough for now. I lied. I did nothing. Not enough at all. Uh, my brain's too small, guys. It says the clicker. Profile someone. Oh! Now I... Who do I profile? You got no information. You got no information. I don't know if I want to talk to your ass again. What do you mean profile someone? What happens down here? Does it say profile someone? These other ones don't say shit. Oh, but there's like another thing I can uh, put here potentially. Thanks, Saga. I'm thinking, dude. I'm thinking, man. He's <laughs> fucking bullying me. Um, there's no other, like, things I could add here. Oh, I can put something else here. No, go back there. No. Okay. I can put stuff... Yes. I I messed up. How to enter. Hmm. 
How to enter what? What are you talking about? Why is it all the way on the floor? Find evidence. Enter the Cauldron Lake overlap by recruiting by reciting the poem. Oh, okay, that's good to know. Uh, the overlap. Okay, but now I have access with this other stuff. The clicker. Wait, I have nothing new. Wait, hold on. What? <laughs> She's make me show my it. There's nothing else to put anywhere else. Huh? I did that like 75 times. Never mind. Uh, don't worry about it. It's not a big deal. Nope. <laughs> nope. So it's light and dark present. Inside a bright light, Saga felt safe. Like nothing could ever hurt could hurt couldn't never hurt her. I I tried that. I'm getting fucking bullied, dude. By this shit. For later. That's not right. Alright, maybe I can talk to Mr. Wick now. Tick tock, Mr. Wick. I can't. Um, it's my birthday. I lied. Well, you know when it's your actual birthday, you're going to get quadruple bad luck for that day. That's the rule, dude. Don't fuck about when it's not your birthday or not, you know? Wait, it's so it's telling me there's something here. Uh, light, dark presence. <sighs> I can't put anything there, and this says for later. So this needs to go somewhere, and I just don't know where. So I'm just gonna try to put it everywhere until it works. Cause this is pissing me off. I'm f I'm a little pissed about that, by the way. Don't tell me that's what I needed. Or now can I profile people because I I found more information. Sure doesn't look like it. Caldor actually? <laughs> yeah, I did everything I could for now, it looks like. So I don't know what else they want from me. Standing inside the trailer at the outskirts of Watery. I already, I already read that. Goals. Learn more about the clicker. But how do I learn more about the thing that I can't learn about? Weapon upgrade five. I can't afford any of this shit. Ooh, is that? Can I drink this? Casey's favorite brand. Oh, no. Tastes terrible. Hey. Probably does. But there is like right here, it says the clicker. Find evidence, read the manuscript. I already read the manuscript. Standing inside the trailer at the outskirts of Watery. Pay Saga attention. Had seen Wake's fabled clicker for the first time. Okay. In the hands of the cult of the tray. Her mind reeled from what the horror story was now claiming about her, her life, her past. She didn't accept it. She stepped out of the trailer. She needed air. But okay. she wasn't alone. A cultist stared at her from behind a deer mask. She drew her weapon. I remember this part. Shouted, ran after him. If she, if she was Calvin IRL, she'd be hella dead right now. What? Just in my in a room making evidence conversation stuff. 